Freedom Park. Uh, next week at our uh, meeting with the DOT Commissioner, one of the things that we're going to ask him for is with the, the finalization of the Miracle League Park and everything that's going on with Freedom, we're going to ask for some uh, uh, some Elmeet money uh, to build a multi-purpose path along Yes Road. So uh, you know, we've had a lot of people asking for this uh, to be able to uh, you know, either ride by or walk uh, or whatever uh, down Yes Road to and from Freedom Park. So uh, the DOT guys have said they've got some Elmead money available for uh, for bike and head stuff. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna see if they're willing to, to put some money into it. And the good thing is with our T's uh passing, we only have to have a two or a ten percent match. So whatever they whatever they put whatever skin they put in the game, we're going to looking at a ten percent match. I think it's a good idea. Are How there any that? quick? Uh, so a little over a mile. Oh yeah, one point four. Are there any questions for Chad or Mike concerning the project? I don't particularly have any comment. Just thank you both, Chad. I know that your involvement in the construction of them and management of them has um, been big, and so I certainly you can tell just by the. the the size of the projects, uh, the list of the projects themselves, that it's you've done a lot to make the, bring, help bring these projects to fruition. So thank you yep. for all the help. <laughs> As y'all know, um, Chad has been requested to assist both the LPRA as well as the Regional Commission on both of their projects this uh, construction as well as uh, the original commissions you build and so forth. So um, and you've been to the LPRA meetings where George has expressed numerous times the reliance that they place on Chad and his input. Expertise. Uh, yeah, and taking the blame. Taking the blame. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Y'all want to talk about water and sewer? Yeah, we got the water and sewer man right here. 